Hey everyone, welcome back to more Let's Play Roddy Out of Stories in the last part. We got our princess captured, and this part we're gonna finally save her after, you know, a month or two of Kenny's letting her stay kidnapped. It was about that month, I'm sorry about the, uh, sorry about that in general. Uh, I'm getting to think this game might be a little bit cursed, and, uh, like, legitimately cursed, like, as in, like, a, an LP curse or something. Since I've definitely seen about four or five uh, Let's Plays of this game that were started, but weren't finished for whatever reason. I didn't... Well, most of them actually got an episode or two into it before stopping. There's another guy who got a good 14 or 15 before he's randomly stopping. Anyways, in this room, you're going to want to hug the outer wall. That way, that enemy in the center of the room can't get you. He's pretty powerful. You can manage him at this level, but it's a bit more than it's trouble than it's worth. And this is actually my second time trying to record this episode. And I am stopped recording the first time so that because I got lost and here I am lost already. Awesome. Anyways, let's just head down this way. Even though this is the exact same way I went, I'm probably going to get lost again. But yes, like I was saying, if you haven't been reading the news feed on my channel, then you probably don't know that I'm... Well, I'm pretty sure I've said this in past parts. But I'm pretty sure uh, I'm going to reiterate it, I guess, that I have moved into my new college and gotten new roommates, whatever, moved into a dorm, or not dorm, but a uh, apartment with two, two of my friends, so they don't technically know I LP yet, so I'm kind of waiting before we get more used to living together before saying anything about that, since they're still already having to adjust to a third person in this house. Which, mainly, the only thing... There's really nothing to do here. <laughs> Since I'm at a college town, that makes sense. Because of where I live, uh, there's absolutely nothing to do in this town, other than... Because I can see why my friend who was going to the hardest, quote, harder school, unquote, was having better grades than I was going to an easy school, because there's, like, absolutely nothing to do here. So, here, you have either the option to, like, play video games, or, uh... During the school week is like go to school. We come home with like you have options to do homework or just do nothing. <laughs> it's the point where doing homework is more fun than not doing anything. It's kind of bad. And I think I actually managed to find my way faster than I ever have before. To the party, oh hi. Sarge, <laughs> or your sergeant here loses his head. You know we could just like. You know, you could just like drop down the ladder or something. You're not actually that much deep shit, but apparently that's makes too. Maybe they're like caught in there together. And meanwhile, Daniel, who's been laying unconscious for the past month, is kind of hasn't stuff. Oh, he's on his back. Sergeant Jack. Yeah, <laughs> we did too. What should I do? What should I do? Uh, uh, I know. Go and get help. Good for you. Go make yourself useful. Even though I have no idea how he's supposed to help, or how on earth he would actually find someone. They would have to go to the sewers and find us, even though it really wasn't that hard, apparently. Deputy You're the kid in Jarvis's squad, right? What happened? Uh, Miss Arnold, I mean the princess. She's been kidnapped. What did you say? You know this music isn't nearly intense enough, because you know. We're being held at sword, right. like at knife's sword, sword throats, and the, the Princess of Radiat is unaccompanied for, and that this sounds like I, find it. You go and warn I don't even know how to describe it. It just sounds like, but wait, a little bit too upbeat or something. There's no time, boy. Anyway, we can't let them get away with the princess, or the guild will never recover its reputation. When the going gets tough, the tough get going. Danger isn't in my. And future. there's the local badass. Meanwhile, Daniel's gonna go right inside and scream, Fire! Fire! Or, so the princess cool. has been kidnapped. He's so cool. I wanna be him like him when I grow up. Screw being an engineer, I wanna be Gerald. Yeah. Yarg. Ooh. And this is like one of the few times you get to see Jarvis voice. without a helmet on. What's wrong, princess? It's thanks to you running off that they're here in the first place. No! I'll be taking this. 
Huh? Who's there? <sighs> so you void thugs are kidnapping now. What's your game, Nocturne? Deputy Churl! Stop that sniveling, you fool. You interrupting! You go there! And he's obviously the big guy who has half a, he has a pee for a brain. Which she has lost further IQ points by getting knocked over. Still haven't lost your touch, eh, Gerald? It looks like you're also as stupid as ever. And you're still the thieving, lying rat of old Nocturne. You shut up! I shot, I you, shot up you up good. good. No, wait. But both! No, it didn't work the first time, buddy. It's too dangerous. I'll finish this. So, Sprinting Shadow Nocturne finally steps forward. <laughs> Looks like these two have a history, huh, guys? Okay, shut up. Elmo, if you don't shut that mouth of yours, I'm going to skewer your tongue. Yeah, I, I'll. I agree with him. <laughs> just like this. Otherwise, he's just that. <laughs> Boss. Uh. <laughs> 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 Let's go. Hey, boss! Don't you want to kill the rest of them? They're nobodies. They're not worth the effort. We don't need the princess either. Just leave her here. <laughs> what a waste! Well, that was a creepy last. <laughs> This is what happens when you don't commentate for a month. Just saying. <laughs> you kind of forget how you commentated before. Meanwhile, all the guards are looking around for them. Did you see them? No, they're not here. Clearly. Damn it. These bandits move fast. Oh, are they are they looking for them? They're apparently looking for this Looks super like sexy squad plus now. Claude. Right. Here's our chance. Because... Let's go. Oh, I mean, wow. <laughs> I mean, uh, Gantz. But I don't think I can go another step. Do you want to go to jail? <laughs> or do you want to touch my boobs? Oh, gosh. Uh, no. I can't help it. Every <laughs> it zooms in on them every time. It should also be worth noting that Cla what Claude is wearing right here is actually... I'll say it in a second. Not a bad night's work. No kidding. That corrupt merchant had quite a stash hidden away. <sighs> What's up with you? Well, I just can't help thinking... It's wrong to steal from others, isn't it? You're worried about that now? It's kind of late for misgivings, you know. Listen, we're really careful, okay? I mean, we only steal from guys who deserve it. Okay. That's right. We don't hurt anyone, and we don't steal from poor folk. That's how honorable bandits always work. Honorable bandits? Yes, I, I think I see what you mean. Maybe. Right. Plus, we always turn down the shady requests that come into the guild. Unlike that creep Nocturne and his thugs. This Mr. Nocturne accepts, uh, dishonorable jobs? Oh, yeah. Real dirty work. They say his clients include some of the top people in the castle. People in the castle? Using void members? It sounds like something is afoot. That's not policies or anything. Yeah, no. whatever. It's nothing to do with us. In void. It's best not to ask too many questions. If you can't Otherwise, you get your tongue skewered. You know what they say, right? Curiosity killed the cat. Well, that's cryptic. Yes. Kind of. But what uh, Gantz that you bring there is uh, the outfit the main character of Star Ocean 2 was wearing, Claude Kenny. That's why I called him Claude. <laughs> because it's... The clothes he's wearing is resembling him. Cause I just said the same thing over again. <laughs> oh my gosh! Why is he the only one wearing? Well, he's probably the only one who did operate it on since he got stabbed. But then he's doing push-ups after being stabbed in the What's with this stomach. Screaming, boy? You could give a guy a heart attack. And you could see him without his patch you off, which is kind of cool. One. I'm sure it's meant to be more disturbing that there's a giant slash across his eye and he's got no iris or pupil or anything that we can see in that eye. I just think that looks really cool. Don't be so quick to bury me, kid. 
After what Nocturne did, can you blame us? <laughs> he didn't I don't know why, they just look so cool to me. me anywhere fatal. He was just toying with me. The arrogance. He stabbed me and I well, didn't even move. Well, it's better than getting killed, right? No, I won't let him make a fool of me. You and Nocturne seem to go back a ways. What happened between you two? Some other time. <laughs> oh, she thanks. This ain't the toilet. Doors open. <laughs> I see you're feeling better. Oh, hey, Chief. Uh, I didn't know it was you. It's all right, Gerald. I'm quite used to your greetings. Yeah. Sorry, Chief. No, stay as you are. <laughs> Darn it. I'm not exactly dressed for visitors. Relax. You don't have many opportunities to rest. You should take advantage of it while you can. <laughs> he didn't look like he was trying to rest. Shut up. <clears throat> How's the princess, by the way? She's safe. However, the castle is taking this incident very seriously. They have asked us to investigate the Void community. Then I have to get ready. No. I already told you. You are to rest until you have recovered. But what about the investigation? Gerald, I think the time has come for you to start grooming a successor. A successor? I'm afraid we can expect more incidents like this to occur in the future. Well, Jack, what do you think? Uh, me? You learned many valuable lessons from this last adventure. I think you are ready to take charge of your own squad. Jack Russell, you are now a sergeant in the guild. Oh, yeah. A sergeant? <laughs> hey, it's no big deal, Jack. Heck, if Jarvis here can do it. <laughs> and just what is that supposed to be? Well, they get drunk on a daily basis, so. I want you to look into the void incident and do whatever you think is necessary. Well, that's vague. Jack, always fight for what's right, and you'll be fine. Okay. If you'll excuse me, gentlemen. You know, that little smile Jack did a second ago it was like, remind me of that, the, like, a smiley you can make in a computer for, like, colon three. Well, you have to Ace. celebrate your promotion. Look like, like, W smile is weird. It's time for some private lessons from Deputy Ooh. Gerald on the tactics every squad leader should know. Don't you ever take a break? <laughs> he never stops moving, apparently. Yeah, it's only been 12 minutes. Wow, I'm actually getting this done in very good timing. But unfortunately, I don't have much practice after this, so I'm not going to be able to record too much today, but oh well. Okay, listen up. You're still pretty green, but if your party combines forces, you can take on some tough, com tough, custom tough customers. <laughs> Combine forces? I'm going to teach you about linking. A good link can double or triple your effectiveness. What's a link? A link is like a military formation. Let's try it out and you'll see. First, I'll teach you to box link. You learn to box link. And how do we use a link? I'll show and show this to you. You always open the menu screen, you see the blah 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 blah, I'll show you myself. You press triangle in the menu, and then here we have the link option. This used to be kind of an empty space, so that's what goes here. Uh, you can set up to four links on any direction pad you can press in the middle of battle. And basically, once you get that in battle... Yes, I... not exactly hard. I don't care. You can change your positions, yes, cool, cool beans. Yes, I know, it's not a herd. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell them. I'm gonna tell them. Don't worry. Come on. Okay. Basically, what he's saying is links take up Volti, X amount of Volti. Use of Link. And you hit the direction on the direction pad, you hit the same uh, direction you've posted in, get them in the center, and you all attack it. They're pretty useful. Hee hee hee. Don't be so cocky. You know, it's. How's he being cocky? <laughs> he's just. I guess he's taking praise. You're not supposed to take. You're not supposed to accept praise. I guess. If you get me your link, the Volti Gauge will fall. When it reaches zero, the link will break. And also, the link will break if you get knocked over too far. But that's. Yeah, I think I've said that before, actually. The better battles you learn, the more links you learn. Or the more battles you use links in, the more links you learn. Exactly. Oh crap! It skills the link system. Basically, what's going on here is that Jack. We have the luck plus. The luck plus skill on Jack's meant on Jack that we've had the entire game. The more links you use, it connects to your party members and you have a chance of learning their skills. Meaning, if you really like a skill a party member has, uh, put them in your party, link a lot, and eventually you'll get the opportunity to learn it. And then you can level up yourself, and it's quite useful. Links are more... Honestly, they're not required for like at all for you to beat the game. I My first playthrough of this game, when I didn't really understand them, 
I pretty much just uh, didn't use them at all. Like, literally, I used them maybe twice, and I thought it sucked, so I didn't use them. I'll try and use them more in this playthrough, so... Yeah. <laughs> hope That's kind of a hoping and not exactly required, I guess. Anyways, now that we're a uh, sergeant of the theater van corps, we have a lot more we can get done. First off, let's talk to... I'm David. I don't even remember you. Can I talk? Can I get David yet? Wah, no. Talk to Gareth over here. Me, I'm Gareth. I'm Gareth. I'm Jack. How did you get to be a sergeant? Hey, tell me Jack of it. Oh, we don't have any more squad. Uh, I guess I'll just go ahead and say hey, well, I was getting that uh, from now on here on out. Never mind. Anyways, talk to him after being promoted to sergeant. He'll challenge you because he doesn't believe you should be a sergeant. Basically, just kick his butt and he'll accept that you're a sergeant. He'll join you. You know, like half of the characters in this game. And basically, what I was going to joke about was that I was planning on. Oh, whatever. Anyways, obviously, he's not difficult. Like, none of these. <laughs> Very few of these battles actually get difficult until later on. But actually, poison. I know, I, I think I've said this before. The poison in this game is extremely overpowered. Like, really overpowered. <laughs> Hopefully, in a few parts, I'll be able to show you why it's so overpowered. It basically allows you access to very, very good characters you're not supposed to get until later in the game. I have seen how good you are, but I still don't believe it. I'm going to tag along, find out the truth. You know, I'm really a dragon kin or something like that. Totally not a spoiler or anything. But I believe I'll call it a part here since I am basically... <laughs> I'm running out of commentary. I've kind of lost that. But anyways, actually I may need to re rush down to the basement here for a second. See if there's a character who's supposedly going to be walking in. No? Okay, over here. Anyways, yes, this has been Awakening Beyond. Thank you all for watching. Uh, again, I apologize for the long wait in parts. Hopefully I'll be able to record another part sometime this week, which hopefully I will. Uh, I'm finding times to record, so... Yeah. Hopefully I'll be able to get this on a couple, two or three times a week basis. That's my hoping for now. Right now, expect more of a one a week until I start actually doing it, which... You know, I'll just shut up and... Hopefully I'll have a next... Another video within seven days. I'll leave it at that. Anyways, yes, this has been a Wednesday Beyond. Thank you all for watching, and hopefully you're not too disappointed about the lack of... You know, I guess screw it. <laughs> I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.